Hi, this is Dean DeCosta, and today we are going to be talking about a new tool, a free tool that's out there by the Mosaic people. Uh, this particular cool tool is called Mosaic Track, and it's an artificial intelligent editor. A really cool tool that does some very interesting things. So what I've done is I've looked up a job description for a technical recruiter, and I'm going to go ahead and copy it and paste it into the editor. And then I'm going to put conversation suggestions. What it's doing now is it's going out there and it is trying to determine um, exactly what it is that's relevant to the job description. In, in this case, you know, obviously recruitment, communication, human resources, all nice, all good, all pretty. What we're going to also do is now look at the job description as a whole. And what it's doing is it's looking for positive words, important words, average, unfavorable words, negative words, and, and, and then sentiment strength. And what that means is this tells you what's the likelihood that your job description will be well received. In this case, you look at the results and you see only one word that is considered negative or unfavorable, and that's the word critical. Okay, uh, understood. Uh, I can understand that critical is a strong word and, and, and everything, but everything else looks really good and shows that this job description is actually fairly well written. A lot of average, so not bad. A lot of very positive and a lot of important, so that's all good. Down here at the bottom, important averages are unfavorable concepts. You got all the greens and the blues. There was no unfavorable concepts, so that's all good. And then positive and negative words. Critical is the only negative word. So we might want to come up with a different word other than critical. Now, that's the part of this that's relevant for job descriptions. Remembering that you could do the same thing with a resume. And then remember, if you do it with your job description, and say you printed this, and then you went ahead and did it with a uh, a resume of somebody who applied and printed the results and looked at them side by side, you'd be able to know fairly quickly, you know, maybe how good a fit they may or may not be, high level, not super uh, intricate, but still a, a decent idea. But this is a great tool and it's 100% free and will remain free and it just gives you all of these options for your job description to tell you if indeed this job description is likely to work or not work. And in this case, this job description overall is a really good job description. The only thing I might consider doing is taking out the word critical and maybe um, putting in another uh, word besides critical. Uh, looking at the way it's written, use and maintain existing applicant tracking systems for capturing all critical prospect uh, and interviewing personal data. Um, you could use the word uh, important instead of the word critical. Important is a little less uh, po a little less of a um, negative word probably. So let's let's find that word critical and let's see if we put in the word important. Now, mind you, important may not be important, may not be the word you want to use either. I'm just coming up with a word to see what happens. Let's see what happens now. Ah, important is considered a positive word. So now critical, and now it becomes a great job description. That's how simple this can do, this tool can do, and what it can do for you, and how it can easily help you write much better job descriptions than you've had before. It can help you write your resume better than you had before, and it can even help you look at a resume and a job description side by side to help correlate maybe if the person's a good fit or not. At long story short, uh, this is a great tool. It's 100% free. This is Dean DaCosta, and this is Mosaic Track.